Hello Celtic supporters, welcome to the Celtic News Channel. If you love this club dearly, go ahead and hit that like button. Here, I bring you the latest updates about our beloved Celtic. And today, I've got some fantastic news for all you devoted Celtic fans regarding the transfer market. Our seventh reinforcement is now confirmed. Speaking of devoted fans, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications because every day I'll be bringing you the latest Celtic updates right here. Celtic is firing on all cylinders this summer transfer window, as Brendan Rodgers is unwavering in his determination to bolster the team in an impressive manner. The seventh edition for this season is virtually secured, with Lewis Palmer set to join the club after both parties reached a preliminary agreement. Palmer's arrival is set to solidify the left wing, paving the way for Maeda to vie for the central striker position. Even with Maeda in the central area, Rogers still aims to bring in another forward. With Hyong Yuo sidelined due to injury, much of the attacking responsibility falls on Kyogo Furuhashi's shoulders for the early matches. But Rogers' ambitions don't stop there. He has his sights on shoring up the defensive line with another central defender and a left back. Furthermore, the coach has assessed Celtic's goalkeeping situation and is determined to recruit another goalkeeper. With Palmer's imminent arrival and the possibility of other reinforcements, Rogers could introduce as many as five new faces to the team ahead of the crucial derby at Ibrox this Sunday. The transfer window slams shut on Friday at midnight, leaving less than a week until the summer transfer window closes. An eventful week lies ahead, and expectations are soaring. Celtic is shaping up for an exhilarating season, and fans are eagerly anticipating how these new additions will impact the team's performance. Dear Green and White supporter, what are your thoughts on this news? Your comments are always invaluable for Celtic to understand what its supporters are thinking. And if you've made it this far, a like would be greatly appreciated to keep me motivated in bringing you more Glasgow Celtic news. Thank you.